Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Gabriela Pagan. Here are your 41 Action News headlines. Former Vice President Joe Biden is campaigning in Missouri today. This morning he made a stop in front of the St. Louis Arch. This afternoon he's coming to Kansas City. We will be live streaming his speech on our Facebook page and on our app. Plus, this afternoon, police are investigating shots fired overnight in, L in Olathe. This all happened near 143rd and Black Bob. Officers found a car that had been shot. No one was in the car and hurt. If you have any information related to this incident, please call the TIPS hotline at 816-474-TIPS. And today marks three years since a tornado hit Oak Grove, Missouri. The EF3 tornado damaged nearly 500 homes. Survivors say it's hard to believe no one died. Since then, the community has been rebuilding. Many of the homes throughout the Oak Grove neighborhood have been restored. Your forecast with Gerard Jabaley is up next. Thank you, Gabby. As we head through tonight, our winds will start to die down a bit, but high fire danger through around 6 o'clock in the evening. We'll still see winds gusty out of the south throughout the evening and through the overnight hours. Temperatures will not be too cold, only dropping into the 40s, uh, likely through Sunday morning. Now, your Sunday will feature more of the wind, but also a good about a sunshine. Temperatures will be pretty warm there, reaching the upper 60s, close to 70 degrees before rain starts to move in. So we will have high fire danger again for Sunday before this rain finally hits as we move into late Sunday night after midnight through Monday morning and that will linger around through your Monday could see uh, some decent rain totals across the area anywhere from a half an inch on the low end to upwards over an inch, especially uh, across the eastern half of our viewing area here. So we could be seeing a good soaking, which will certainly help with some of that wildfire danger as well. Remember to get all your latest news and weather updates anytime on chsb.com.